Hi guys. Thank you so much for showing up this month. Hello, hello. This is How to Love Yourself Affirmations um, for July 2019. Hello, hello. If you are new here with me, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. And if you are subscribed to me and follow me on my various social media platforms, thank you very much. Thank you guys for all of your birthday love. It was fantastic. Thank you so much. But it's time to get back down to business, guys. Um, so you already know how we get down. This is going to be that beautiful series, Love Yourself Affirmations for each zodiac sign. We start in order of the Western zodiac. Let's get it popping. So this is going to be for the beautiful sign of Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If you have Taurus in your chart, connecting with one, um, you know, whatever is going on with you, where Taurus may apply, this is for you. So Taurus, let's get right into it. I take a nice deep breath and release all resistance to healing. Now, this is interesting, Taurus, because you are a fixed energy sign. So resistance is a part of just what happens with you naturally. Some people may call it stubborn. Shh, I have Taurus in my chart. But anyway, that's actually a better word. Stubborn is not necessarily a word that I like. <laughs> However, sometimes it is necessary. In this particular message, resistance is probably the better word for all of you Torians out there, sun, moon, rising, or Venus. You know where you stand firm on something and it is hard to sway you when you have your mind made up. In this particular case, you're being guided to affirm that whatever you have been resistant to changing is unfortunately standing in the way of your individual healing as it pertains to loving yourself. So if you can find it in your heart to listen to this message that spirit has for you, we'll go over it one more time and get you out of here. I take nice a nice deep breath and release all resistance to healing. I listen with love to my body's messages. I listen with love to my body's messages. So again, your affirmation is that there is something that your body is telling you to do. There's something that you're being guided to do. And it's not that you're stubborn. It's just that in which the view in which you look at things, Taurus, just keeps you a little restricted and in this case, spirit is coming to tell you that it's time because whatever you are resisting is holding you back from ultimate healing, which in turn holds you back from something that you really do need to be achieving, that you need to be manifesting, that, you know, you need to be experiencing. And that's just what it is. So again, I take a nice deep breath and release all resistance to healing if it were only that serious, right, Taurus? Therefore, you're being guided to affirm, to listen with love to your body's messages. So again, um, you are crossing with the Capricorn, which is interesting, Taurus, because that's, for, that's earth energy, but Cap energy is cardinal. So maybe there is a cap you're connecting with. Maybe Capricorn is significant somewhere in your chart. Or maybe you're just being guided to kind of go into some of that Capricornish energy, which should not necessarily be that hard for you, saying it's how you, got, you guys are in the same element. But uh, only you know where that resonates. So I certainly hope this message resonated with at least one Taurus out there. Like, share, subscribe to my marvelous tribe on youtube if you have not done so already um this is my non-tarot series but if you're interested in tarot readings i do offer that on my channel so please go over there and check me out everybody else drop a like it's hot in those comments let me know how you're feeling about this particular message and taurus i will see you guys next month when we do it again bye guys